Hey, what's up guys? It's Shadow here, and in today's video, we will be going over the death of Project Slayers. So yes, you may have heard about Project Slayers, as it was the most popular Demon Slayer game ever. Since over a year ago, the game has only had one update since release though, and honestly, the game hasn't been really fun. It's been pretty dry, there's been no new content for the last 8 months, and I'll be telling you guys why this is. So yeah, I'll just get straight to the point guys. First off, please subscribe and like on the video, and let's get into it. So the owner Uwop does not care about the game anymore. He's not going to update the any game anymore. Got straight to the point. That's literally what's happening. I'll post images right now on the screen. So people have asked him, you know, why haven't you been caring about this game? Why are you working on other games? And he essentially just said that if he actually cared, the game would be on update 10 by now. But guess what guys, we're still on update 1, and a lot of you guys are expecting a new update with the new Demon Slayer season coming along. Well no guys, don't expect the new update, it's never coming out, the game is essentially done for. For the future of this game, I think it's going to be sold to a different developer with a new guy who actually cares about it. And yeah, so a lot of you guys thought that, you know, this will be like GPO, where they're going to take a 3-6 to six month break, do the hardest update ever, but no. We, got, we waited the 3-6 to six months, but there is no update waiting for us. Instead, it's the codes that the owner gave out, which really do nothing for us. He could give us a million spins. What am I going to do with it if there's no new content? So yeah. So the owner said that basically he doesn't like the old engine the game was running on essentially, and it doesn't suit, his, it doesn't suit him anymore. And he made it clear that the game will not be updated, as the owner himself does not even care about the game's development. He also said that it doesn't matter if the game even peaks to a 100k player count since it baselines to under 5k players anyways. So he keeps thinking that, you know, the game it can peak up to like even a million players, who knows. But at the end of the day, it's still going to come back down to 5k. And he says that he wants a game that there's always going to be like, you know, consistent player count, like a good 10k plus player count, like Blocks Fruits, for example. So yeah, I don't, guys. He's been, um, he literally does not care about Project Slayers, and the player count really supports that claim. And the codes he's been giving out recently are not helping either. The owner has hence been working on projects such as Pixel Piece. And we all know what happened to Pixel Piece, guys. It, it It's basically in shutdown right now. Um, there's also been a frequent data loss issue in Project Slayers as well. I don't know if you guys have been keeping up, but like for the past week, every morning... He's been trying to like revamp the, like the something in the game because there's keeps data lossing issues. And yeah. And guys, I actually enjoyed this game a lot. I didn't hate the game at all. When the game first released, I remember playing with my friends and I remember the first update happened. The game actually had a lot of content and it was actually very fun to play. However, what was not fun is me getting two different accounts, one Agatsuma and one Komodo, and thinking that, you know, the new sun breathing style is coming out. So I got a whole Komodo account that I had to re-roll on. Got it to max level. It's the account you're seeing me play on right now. Just to find out that the sun breathing update will never happen. So I wasted my time. And the rates on this game are pretty bad too. 0.1% is not justifiable. I don't care what developer you are. You should make the rates lower. I don't know who set the new cap at 0.1%. But that's a horrible rate. You guys are just money grabbing at that point. But yeah guys. So some people think the game will come up to... Yeah so. The owner has basically in a sense given up on this game. To work on better projects i don't know what projects but he's saying he's gonna work on better stuff i honestly don't think there's gonna be something better than this project series game he's made this was the best potential he had and he basically ruined it which is fine that's his decision but i honestly think he should have kept working on this game it had a lot of potential with it and yeah the first yeah so the games was amazing uh you know lots of tens of thousands of people played it at the time i remember when the game first updated People were doing the raids in the Discord call. It was crazy. And yeah, the game had potential. A lot of you guys expected it to come back soon. Like, you guys are probably waiting for the update. It's never coming back, guys. I'm sorry to disappoint you. But yeah, as the owner Uwap was saying how he's going to work on better projects, let me know what projects you guys think he's going to work on in the comments below. The game, it's really unfortunate that I had to go out like this. There was no official an announcement except the little messages he was typing out a general chat to his community which he even called lame at a point and he doesn't really appreciate the community he gave up on the game he's working on projects such as pixel piece which is gonna die to rel c soon anyways and yeah guys 
uh please let me know your thoughts on project slayers did you guys tell me what you grinded for tell me if you are happy about the game stoppage if you're not happy with it and yeah let me know your thoughts and ideas in the comments below i'll see you guys in the next video peace